cool thing that I never knew about Lululemon until like recently was that all the zippers have like a hair elastic. Like this is actually a hair elastic that you can take off. If you didn't know that, let me know in the comments down below. I want to know if you knew that or not. Hey everybody, I'm so excited for today's video because we are going to be talking about the one, the only, lululemon on friday i had uploaded my legging collection video and a lot of you were commenting about lululemon so i thought for today's video what we'd do is we would sit down and just go through my pieces from lululemon because i know a lot of you are actually going to be getting some pieces this year i picked up two other pieces but you're able to see the pieces that i have from there that i recommend and i really like to get and I think are worth the money. And then at least this way you kind of have a size guide, a size range and everything like that. So without further ado, let's get into this video. If you're new, make sure to subscribe. And if you're returning, it is so nice to see you all again. So let's go. So I have quite a few things in here. I typically only buy things when they're on sale because I feel like that is the best time. I actually am thinking about doing a couple different Lululemon videos and when I was on there, I seen that they had a sale still. But I went in on Boxing Day and I found myself two pieces, so I'm gonna be talking about the two pieces today and then just showing you guys some other pieces that I have from Lulu. So the very first sports bra is going to be the Flow Y sports bra. These are $52. I believe I picked this up on sale for like $38. So always check the we made too many section or the sales section for them. This is made out of their new Lou fabric. The new Lou material is more of like a softer material if you're wondering what the new Lou feels like. These also come in many different colors. So like I said, you can always check the We Made Too Many section to see if there are any prints or colors that are on sale. And these come in size two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, and 14. I am a size four in the sports bra. I normally wear a size small sports bra. This is more of a low impact sports bra. So this is something that I like to wear on basically maybe very casual workouts. If I'm gonna do like yoga, maybe just an arm day or just to relax. Or if I wanna just wear a baggy t-shirt with a sports bra, this is perfect for it. Again, I did not pay full price for it. I've had it for over a year and I still think it's like brand new condition honestly so if you were looking for a nice low impact sports bra these are the way to go but their new loop fabric is something that is very very soft and buttery feeling as opposed to like a wonder under material so as for the detailing on this it's just a plain sports bra it's got like a nice cut in the front this one is more of a smaller and shorter fit so it is a lot more revealing it's got just a little band in the bottom it has removable cut pads and on the back the straps are just very thin so in the back the straps kind of just go like in a y which is probably why it's called the flow y sports bra but in the back it's just very very like delicate and it's just really really nice and just a comfortable casual sports bra so the next sports bra that we are going to talk about, again, I got this on sale. This is one that I could fit into a six for sure if I wanted to, but I do like the amount of compression that it gives, so it doesn't really bother me. But if a six was on sale, I would pick it up because it would fit me almost the same. So this is the Energy Sports Bra. This is their luxury material. They're $54. Again, they come in many different colors. This has 13 colors. So I'm sure if you go on there, we made too many. There's probably other patterns and colors on sale. Again, it comes in size 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, and 14. So I do fit more of a 4 to a 6 in this one. So they run a little bit tighter than the Flow Y one because the material is a lot more different. So the Energy Sports Bra is more of like a thicker material, but it is still stretchy. It is a four-way stretch. This is breathable and sweat wicking. If you wear like an open back top, you get to see the strap. I like the sports bra because it's not like a racer back but it still gives you enough compression and support. If I ever want a nice like supportive and compression sports bra, this is one that I choose because it fits me really well. This one's more of like a more snug fit, which I like. It gives you nice compression. It's a little bit higher in the front, so it's not as revealing. And it's also got like a little bit of a band on the bottom. Now they do actually have like a longer length version of this. So if you're looking for something that you would want maybe in between like a sports bra and a crop top and you really like this sports bra or you want just like a sportive sports bra that's almost like a crop top they do actually have a longer version of this which is really cool and i'm thinking about getting it but i do really really like these i would highly recommend getting this one for like an everyday sports bra because of how much i actually like it and wear it a lot 
The other part about this is it has the removable cup pads, just like the other one did. I bought it about a year and a half ago. This is still like held up, kept its shape, kept its form. It still looks really, really nice and I absolutely love it. So moving along from the sports bras, now we are going to talk about the leggings. I just did a video on the leggings. You can find more information about these pieces in other videos that I talked about. Today's just a very, very brief video on the pieces and just to help you guys out a little bit and to show you guys my new pieces. First pair of leggings are going to be the Train Times leggings. These are still on sale if you're looking for a really nice pair of leggings from Lululemon. These leggings are very, very breathable. They're squat proof. They're very flattering because of the seams. They're high-waisted and they are full length. They're not too, too long on me, so they're a very flattering length. They have like a nice breathable strip of mesh on the sides, which looks very, very nice and it's very flattering. You can get these in cropped or full length. The full length are actually on sale from like $69 to $79 and they're originally $108. So that's a really, really good price because again, I have had these now for a year and like a couple months and they are still lasting me a very long time. So they come in a size 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and 12. So they are made out of the Luxe Dream fabric. Again, it's like that four-way stretch. So they will have more of like a compression and form-fitting feel to it. So if you were looking for something that has a little bit more structure to it or if you have like the Energy Sports Bra, these are made out of the same material. So these are everybody's tried and true, trusted leggings, the Align leggings. These here are the cropped version and they are $98. But again, if you go on there, we made too many. I guarantee you, you're gonna find colors or prints that are gonna be a lot less expensive. These here are made out of their Nulu fabric. These ones here are $88. They are the cropped ones and they are the 21 inch leggings. I try and stick to crop leggings when it comes to leggings because I am 5'1". So these ones are a nice length. I do want to get myself a pair of black or like dark gray align leggings that are a little bit longer to have like as a day-to-day -day legging. These are really good for like a basic, basic workout to go lounge around in, to go for a walk, to do yoga because they're very nice and just they flatter you so, so well and they are so, so comfortable. Now these have lasted me a very long time. If you maybe watch other people or talk to other people, they say that they pill or they rip quickly. They're not made for like extreme workouts in my opinion. I don't wear these on leg day. Although they're flattering, very comfortable, squat proof, and just amazing leggings, I don't wear them for days where I know my leggings are gonna be rubbing against mats or rubbing against dumbbells or rubbing up against like machines for whatever reason because that's going to make them wear, pill, or rip a lot faster. They are a nice like thick material, like they're not extremely thin, but they are very, very delicate feeling. So these are more of like a, like yoga, going for an outside run, going for a nice walk type of legging but these are a nice step into Lululemon if you're not sure what to get, especially because a lot of the times when these go on sale, they go down to like, I seen, I think I picked these up for like $56. So a lot of the time you can get these on sale for a very, very affordable price. And then you can learn how to take care of your Lululemon and have a good pair at the same time. <laughs> so we are gonna get into tops. If you didn't notice, you probably can't, but this is actually a Lululemon top that I picked up on Boxing Day, but we're gonna talk about my oldest thing from Lululemon that I purchased for full price. This is over two years old and I wear it to this day, and there is no way that I can get rid of it. I have one little, little teeny tiny, like little pull on it that I could honestly just take like a little needle and just pull it back and it'd be okay. Other than that, it's in perfect condition and it actually feels the same as this brand new top. So I have taken care of this so, so well and I'm so happy that I did because it was well worth the money. This is the Swiftly Tech Long Sleeve Crew. It is $78. So these are made out of 60% nylon, 37% polyester, and 3% spandex. So what I noticed about these tops is you can wear it basically for any season because it's a really nice breathable top, but at the same time, it can keep you nice and warm. The other part is they're stretchy, but at the same time, they're not overly stretchy, so they will fit to your body really, really nicely. So if you're someone who likes to wear long sleeves in the gym and you just want that one perfect long sleeve, I would highly recommend this one because it's so breathable, but at the same time, it's not too cool, but it's not too hot. It's just that perfect material and perfect 
perfect balance. The other part about this though is you do have to be careful again that you're not going to be having like barbells like sit on your top or you don't want anything to like snag it or rip it in any way so you just have to be careful but like I was saying I've had this for two years now or over two years and I have worn it for every single workout and it's in perfect condition so even though they're expensive I wear this all the time so for me to have it for that long, to wear it for that long, it's worth the money. This one is basically the same as a long sleeve. It's a lightweight t-shirt, it's a breathable. It's got the perfect size of sleeves. I love how this fits, even the neck too, because it's not too low, but it's also not too high. So I absolutely love the necks of these. They're very, very breathable. They're perfect for like cardio. So the Swiftly Tees actually have something in them to inhibit the growth of odor. I have noticed that because I can go a couple days without having to wash those tops or some Sometimes even when I'm sweating in them, I'm not really smelling anything, so that's really good also. So originally this one is $68. I was able to get it for $39 for final sale. So if you're looking for a really, really good gym t-shirt that's basically going to be good for any workout, I would highly recommend this one. So I have three hoodies. One of them I have talked about many times. It's a cropped hoodie that I can no longer find on Lululemon. Honestly, that's my favorite cropped hoodie and it has lasted me over a year and a half now. I really love it. It's the perfect crop length. It's the perfect fit. So if you're thinking about getting like a hoodie or you're looking for a good cropped hoodie, I would definitely recommend checking out Lululemon because of how long they last. The other part about that hoodie is the hood actually doesn't bother me. Where sometimes when I have like other hoodies that are cropped, I find that the hood part actually just takes over and it just, you have to constantly readjust and pull it down and that one I don't have to. It's a very soft material. I've taken care of it. It You can tell I've taken care of it and I just love that. So if you were thinking about a hoodie or you were looking for a good one, definitely check out Lululemon for some. I actually got that one on the We Made Too Many so I wasn't sure what size to get because you can't return anything that's on the we made too many section and it's like final sale for if you could find a hoodie on sale and you're not really sure what size to get personally i would say to size up because i would rather have like a hoodie that's a little bit bigger than too small so i sized up i'm happy it fits me good i still have it it's just in the laundry. So the next thing was something that I actually bought online that was secondhand. I believe I paid about $20 for this. It was like 18, I think. And it is just an older scuba hoodie. Now it was in purple, so I had to pick it up because I loved it so much. The other cool thing that I never knew about Lululemon until like recently was that all the zippers have like a hair elastic. Like this is actually a hair elastic that you can take off if you didn't know that. Let me know in the comments down below. I wanna know if you knew that or not. So again, I'm not gonna be able to find this exact one online because of how old it is, but I wear it all the time because it is such a really snug, form-fitting, just cozy, compression-y type of feel to it. And I absolutely loved it so much. So for the longest time, I was wearing this forever, really wanting a new one. But these are so expensive. It was secondhand from someone else. I still have it. It's in good condition. I've worn this now for like half a year or longer. So no, I've had this for over a year also. So they're really, really good hoodies. Then I got on sale on Boxing Day a new one. So this one here is a scuba hoodie, but I'm not sure if there's different versions or not, or maybe they're just not as like built and structured as they were in the past. But when I felt this one, I thought this is going to be so nice and perfect for just everything so i don't wear these for the gym but i do wear these out and about all the time again they still come with like the hair elastics i really liked this one it was between this or a pink one and because i already had a purple i went for like the they went for like the darker charcoal gray type of color so this here has like the gold on it it was so nice i had to pick it up so again it's not as structured as that one but i'm not sure if they have like different type of scuba hoodies if you know let me know in the comments down below this one here is more of like a lightweight type of material to it it feels a lot more like a cotton material which is so nice and on the inside it is lined just like the other one so the fabric here is a blended light cotton fleece 
it's breathable it is really soft against your skin it's lightweight and it provides some warmth so this one here retailed for $118 and I got it for $89 and that's why I picked it up so for this one I did get my original size for in and it fits me absolutely perfect so I would say if you're an extra small normally in jackets to go for a size 2 but if you're more so a small go for a 4 that's what I'm going to reference it as but if you were thinking about getting like a scuba jacket or if you were looking for like that one perfect zip up jacket I would recommend these for sure I have jackets and like zip up jackets that I like but I just don't like how they buckle and that is the one thing I could spend 50, 60, 70 dollars on a jacket, let's say. And if it buckles, I'm going to get rid of it. And these ones don't for me. Not just that, I find a lot of them stretch out on the bottom and these don't for me. They fit me very, very nicely and I can wear them for anything. And it also just makes it look like more dressed up when you wear one of these. The hoods are so, so nice and they just feel nice and sturdy as well. So these scuba jackets are also a great choice to get from Lululemon. So those are my recommendations. I have two Swiftly tops, I have two scuba hoodies, I have two pieces in the Nulu fabric and I have two pieces in the Luxstream fabric. So you can kind of tell the pieces that I really like and the pieces that I would highly recommend. I have had really no issues with Lululemon because if something goes wrong, where there's loose threads, if something gets a rip in it or anything like that, I just go online and I message them and they're really, really good to either replace the item or give you like a store credit. So that is another reason why I like to get Lululemon. Is it necessary to get a whole wardrobe out of it? Absolutely not. But I do like to treat myself from time to time when pieces go on sale or when someone is selling something of a really good quality because then at least this way I can fill my closet with staple pieces that are going to last me years and I know I'm going to be comfortable and confident in. Everything is going to be linked and my sizes are going to be in the description. So let me know in the comments down below if you knew that the zippers were actually like little hair elastics. And I do plan on doing a couple more Lululemon videos that I know are going to be very exciting. So make sure to give this a thumbs up. And if this gets to 30 thumbs up, I will do another one. And let me know in the comments if you guys want to see that. Go follow me on my social media and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.